hello friends welcome to my channel today we are going to going to see Lawson rearrangement reaction so what is Lawson rearrangement Lawson the thermal acid or base catalyst intramolecular conversion of hydrozymic acids to isocyanates and um, further on hydrolysis to um, amines primary amines is called Lawson rearrangement we will see general reaction Suppose this is a hydroxamic acid. It gets converted into isocyanate. When um, through Lawson rearrangement, and when it, and it undergoes hydrolysis. To form primary amines, it means that we get a. It means that we get a lower amine from higher amines. So how this happens? Now we will see that mechanism. Is mechanism first? Uh, it this mechanism is uh, there are two theories that is acid base. Uh, acid catalyzed uh, reaction rearrangement so we can see that see that the mechanism of acid catalyzed rearrangement is of three steps now we will see the step one first the first we take hydroxamic acid in acid catalyzed rearrangement we take acid for its hydrolysis we take acid this acid attacks on the OH negative group of the hydroxamic acid and removes water molecules how this happens we will see that R O N H O H by 2 oxygen gets positive charge and to stabilize this it takes electron and removes as a water molecule this is the first step now in the second step that is uh, deprotonation H positive is removed and we get uh, nitrine now we will see that second step step 2 that is deprotonation in this step the nitrine formed nitrine is formed the, here the H positive ion is removed and we get a nitrine Now this nitrogen is unstable, so it undergoes hydro, uh, it undergoes rearrangement, which we call Lawson rearrangement to form isocyanate. Now we will see step three. This is the third step, that is rearrangement. Rearrangement of what? Alkyl group, alkyl or aryl group. Here it forms a bridge between carbon and nitrogen. And after that it gets completely transferred to the 
nitrogen to form nitrine here we get a isocyanate this is the isocyanate molecule this isocyanate molecule instantly undergoes hydrolysis to form primary amines lower primary amines so suppose this is a uh, this carbon gets removed and we get rnh2 that is one carbon uh, is removed and so we get a lower primary amines now we will see how um, base catalyzed second that is base catalyzed rearrangement now we have a hydroxamic ester and H O H now in this reaction we use base as a catalyst that is OH negative we provide OH negative ions in the as medium this OH negative ions abstract the proton from the molecule so that we uh, H positive ion is removed as a H2O and we get a like this molecule now here deprotonation occurred that is S positive is removed by the base now in the second step this OH this hydroxide group is removed now we will see that how it is removed RCO and OH now this oxygen is electron it will abstract it will take the electron pair towards itself and will get removed as follows and in the third step this nitrogen molecule with rearrange it will rearrange to form the isocyanate this is a transition state and a bond formation will take place double bond will form between the carbon and nitrogen and single bond between nitrogen and alkyl or aryl group now this isocyanate is formed which will undergo hydrolysis to form primary amines now here in hydroxamic acid the migrating group is either alkyl or aryl this is the migrate migrating point that is equal migrating migratory origin and this is the migratory terminus the alkyl or aryl group with transfer from migratory origin to migratory termi ter terminus to form isocyanate and this is this is we call Lawson rearrangement this is the rearrangement we call Lawson rearrangement so now you have understood that if you have any queries then please comment in the comment box and if you like this video then please like like the video uh, share uh, Press the like button, share the video and subscribe my channel for more videos and keep motivating me with your feedback. Thank you.